There he is. Look at that. That is a big muley. I, I don't have to know about the scoring system. Look at that. God almighty, he's a monster. Just waiting for him to stop. Alrighty. Hello and welcome to the channel. And for today's video, well, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Uh, it, it, it's time to do some Hunter Classic. Uh, this is a somewhat fresh account. I only have a few hunts on it, mainly because I kind of lost the login info from, well, back when I used to play Hunter Classic before Call of the Wild came out. I'm crossing my fingers to get some Whitetail, maybe some Mule Deer today. Honestly, God, I, I always forget that this game is, what, nine years old? Going on nine years old? Still looks fantastic. Anyway, so I have the, uh, uh, as you saw, the 243, because that's what you get. Ammo's cheap. Binos, bleak collar, and a camera. I haven't really messed with the camera a whole lot. Now, for those who are used to me playing in, like, ultra-realism mode on Call of the Wild with everything turned off, that's not going to be the case here. I kind of want to get over to here. Might have been actually faster to go from the other spot. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Now, as a refresher to remember all my buttons, I uh, I did manage to actually nab me a pretty decent buck yesterday. Yeah, I'll throw a photo on screen or something. And uh, in the process, I forgot which key was auto walk, and I didn't know you could do this. But uh, apparently, while you're walking, you can go ahead and play a game. So I'm going to do that while I get into the way of deer. Oh, jeez. Oh, now that is not a bad looking mule deer right there. I think what I want to try and do is get up to this hill here. He might be wandering off though, but definitely not bad looking. Okay, he is kind of wandering away though, so I'm going to put some calls in as I move up to this hill. Well, it shows him to be like right here. See, now you're able to manipulate the call. I actually don't know if that makes a difference. Those little short bursts, I, I definitely got a pretty fast vocal response out of them. Oh, he walked right up already? Down here, down here. Oh no, that's a doe. That's another doe. <gasps> Hi. No, no, not me. Okay. Oh no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Look at all of them. There were a whole bunch down there. Okay, hang on. Did you buggers just spook off that buck? I don't see him. Wait, wait, is that him? Yep, yeah, there he is. I just got uh, Whitetail behind me, I think. No, that says Mule Deer as well. Shoot, so there's Mule Deer behind me and one in front. Oh, there he is. He's coming in, though. I don't have a rangefinder, so what I'm going to do is mark the map and then just quickly look, and that is 122 meters right there. You know what? Oh, wait, what's that over there? I think that's a doe. Not a great shot. I think I held high. Still running around out there. Now, unlike Call of the Wild, these animals will lay down wounded. Uh, so I don't want to go after him just yet because he may not be down. He may, or like, he may lay down, but he may not be dead. So I'm just moving up here to see if I can get eyes on, see where he went. Son of a biscuit. He's somewhere over there. All right, I'm just going to give it a minute, and then uh, it's time to go track him down. Actually, I could move up and see what kind of shot I got. Yeah, let's do that. So always got to be wary. It never fails. Normally I take these shots and that's when a bunch of deer and whatnot will sit there and run out from a bush somewhere. All right. It looks like there's the shot. Body shot. I believe that would be the equivalent of a flesh shot. So I need to be very careful coming up here because he may not be dead and I don't want to bump him and have to chase him across the map. Well, if I'm to believe this thing, he's not dead. Well, let's see if we can call him back in then. Ah, he might be actually smart enough not to fall for the same trick twice. He's right up there somewhere. I also saw a hog running around in the field over there. No, you shush. You're not what I'm looking for. All right, it's been a good minute, and he's gone silent. Oh, I hear something right next to me. Oh, pig. Okay, I saw it. Anyways, mule deer. I think it's worth pursuing. 
Oh, I, I can't get this shot. Oh, I just, yeah, he folded. Okay. Whew. Well, one downside, trying to give my all that last little pixel adjustment. Uh, it did a noise. Work is planned. I wonder how long he was standing up there and he was just behind that bush to me. Didn't he fold? As far as, oh yeah, there he is. Not a bad looking mule deer. Oh, I always forget these guys have collisions. <laughs> you try and do the qual, they call the wild thing of stomping down the grass and it doesn't work, so. But preemptively, I'm gonna put myself here. And uh, I guess both shots were neck shots. He's a 148. I haven't the foggiest idea if that's good or not. I'm gonna take a whack, he's, that's not huge. Uh, but you know what? I want a picture. Oh, here, uh, body shot, neck, shoulder, neck bone. So the second shot was that one. The first one, I must've just like grazed him. Yeah, I think that'll work. There's something right there in there. Or is that a bush? I think that was a bush. All right. Moving on. Supposedly, there's another mule deer this way somewhere. And of course, it's gonna start to rain. The game heard me. What's that? You need to see far? Here, have some rain, that'll help. It'll wash the lenses. A frickin' rainbow. Hang on a second. That's cool. There's a rainbow. Why, why is that so astonishing? <gasps> Ooh. Look at that. All right, that's fine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this ridge line here, crawl up across the right of it. Dang it. I saw a whole bunch of uh, sign right back there, and I had a feeling. It's like, I'm, I'm going to walk over this hill and walk right up on them. Yep. Well, there's a coyote over there. Now, I don't have stands. I may have mentioned this already. So I like to use the medved technique of here's a rock. Now, hopefully I'll be able to sit tight, let out some calls, maybe play some more uh, smash it or break it or whatever that was called and uh, wait for this guy to come back in. Oh, there he is. Look at that. That is a big muley. I, I don't have to know about the scoring system. Look at that. God almighty, he's a monster. So I'm gonna plan my shot here. I want him to come like right over this hill and that hill is under 100 yards, or under 100 meters. It's gonna be a horrible angle. I might have to wait till he gets really close. What do we got there? So that one's not as big. Oh, wait. Oh, oh look at that. Wait, where did these guys come from? Yeah, like, there's some white tail coming in too. There's a white tail doe and then two mule deer does. I need to keep my focus on this guy though. No, 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 no. Just waiting for him to stop. So there's two mule deer bucks in there left, and I think a white tail. But definitely drop the big guy. Oh my god. You see the size of this thing. I know, I know. There's probably people you call that big. Yes, I do. I haven't exactly played the game enough to know, uh, if it isn't, you know, I might be able to sit back here and pick a couple of those out. Look at that. Dropped him on the spot and everything. All right, let's see what we can do here. And I nailed him for a left lung heart shot. He's a 191, 493. Is that good? I assume that's good. It might be good. I don't know. But let's see what I can do here with this, uh, this here trophy majig. Uh, fall back a little more. Fall back a little more. Oh, oh. Hey, it, nope. Grab it. It, it, nope. Need this time. Hear me. Yep. Nope. Sorta. Maybe? No, because then I need... Uh, no, because then I need him... I, ga I gotta have his head this way. Nope. Nope. <laughs> uh, I, it, it's gonna be a minute. Oh, wait. That might work. There we go. Oh, that took a... That took a second. They have not wandered far. Oh, there's that white-tailed doe. You know, it, it really does make me wonder if I'm gonna be able to get him to come back in. I got time. Right there. Something moving out there. Doe. There it is, behind the tree. Now well, that has, uh, those both have antlers. I can see them, they're just kind of like doing little circles down over there. Oh, right there. Got something right there. Yep, that one white-tailed doe. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and let her come all the way in and just to see if the bucks come back. If not, 
I don't know. <laughs> I guess I wasted some time. Hey, hey, hey. Three bucks. Is this... I hope this dough doesn't spook him. I think I want that one on the left. Woohoo! There they go. I mean, I'm just lying on a rock out here. This is fantastic. <laughs> I would not, uh, I would not be upset with grabbing those other two. Just saying. I mean, especially at this point in the game, when you're when you're this early on, money's money, right? Yeah. Definitely not as big as the last one. Definitely bit the biggest of the three that walked up. And he was a 144. The other one was a 190 something. Yeah. Still, left lung, liver, body shot. Not bad. And uh, I'm just going to sell him. And you know what? I'm going back to my rock. I wouldn't mind having me a couple more of these fellers. The muleys are coming back. All right. What? Over there. Over there close? That's not... No, right there. Oh, good. It's the bigger of the two. Oh, the small guy's there, too. All right. Got him. Yeah, he's not... Uh, he doesn't have the front split, but he's not bad looking. I'm still happy with that. See what we got. All right. Call the wild moment. Look at the sky. Doesn't work. So he was only a 134. So the smallest of the three that I pulled out of this group. But that was a pure heart shot. Love it. I am just going to sell him for credits, though. And I got an achievement. Whatever the heck that means. It's been so long since I played this game. Do I try and go four for four? Feels incomplete if I don't, doesn't it? Ah, yeah. All right. I got time. Oh, good. He's coming back. Getting closer. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. There he is. The last of the mule deer of this herd. I want to wait for him to step out in front of those flowers. Give me a clear shot. Look at him trying to show off that rack. It, don't. You're embarrassing yourself. Ooh, there was a last second twitch there I thought I missed. Yep, he's he's not a big one. And that wasn't a heart shot. That was left lung liver. And apparently at uh, 39 meters, that just dropped him on the spot. Hey, I get 20 credits. The scope I want only costs 10,000. So getting there. All right, but I think that's going to do it for this one. I've taken every buck out of that herd. Uh... If that was even the same group as the first buck, then that's, what, five? I pulled five out of there, and one monster, and two pretty good looking. I'm happy with that. Now, I don't normally do this, but I am going to ask, if you'd comment down below, would you like to see more classic? I actually really enjoy this game. Uh, Call of the Wild has better graphics, obviously, and, and it's but it's different. Classic is much more in-depth when it comes to the mechanics of hunting, and, uh... Not to mention, it's nice once in a while to play a game that doesn't make my system cry. And the other thing you may have noticed, I love the population density. To me, the population density seems much more realistic. I mean, I, d I haven't run into 300 deer yet. Anyways, there's there's many reasons to go on about why Classic has benefits over Call of the Wild. And honestly, I'd love to see him just take Classic and put it on a new engine. Give it new graphics and be done with it. But that's just me. All right. Well, there's buttons if you liked it. Buttons if you didn't. And as always, buttons to push. Until next time.